tensions boiled over because there was a shit ton of miscommunication. Me and my good friend got thrown under the bus, and I ended up leaving. Needed to leave a five-year campaign. Doing this on a throwaway because I don't want my friends finding this. I recently just left a five-year-old D&D campaign. Not only that, I sort of left the friend group too. I've known everyone in this group since I was a freshman in high school, and the campaign started then too. One of the people in the group managed the D&D club at our high school, and frankly, I got into it because of them. I had so many fun times with them, but I think it all started to slowly fall apart once I hit college. At least for me, that's what happened. I started talking to them less, not only because I was busy, but I also kind of didn't want to be in the campaign anymore. It was for multiple reasons. For one, the DM and I have a history that I don't want to delve into. He's not a bad person by any means, but I just feel awkward talking to him now. One of the other players just rubs me the wrong way, and even now, I don't understand why the people in the friend group are friends with him. He's kind of polarizing, and people seem to recognize that, but for some reason, they just can't let him go. There are two other people in the group that I'd consider friends, but I've grown apart from them too. There's only one person in the group that I consider to be a steadfast friend of mine, and he's really been helping me through all this. Long story short, tensions boiled over because there was a shit ton of miscommunication. Me and my good friend got thrown under the bus, and I ended up leaving. I know I'm being super vague, I'm sorry. I honestly just came here to vent about this because I feel super lost now. I've had plenty of friendships die, but I think it was just the volatile nature of this one that really stung me. I didn't want it to end this way, I just wanted to quietly leave without another word, but the DM insisted we talk to one another, and now here we are. And goddamn, I'm gonna miss that campaign. Yeah, it wasn't perfect, but I loved my character. I really grew up alongside him over the years I played this campaign. I watched everyone grow up, and gotta be honest, I'm sad I won't really see how it ends now. And it's not like the other campaigns. I am with plenty of other people who care for me too, and I love these stories just as much, if not even more. But it still hurts, you know? I know leaving is what was good for me, but I can't help but feel like a coward doing so. Maybe this was all avoidable. But if I'm being honest, I don't think this was really all that avoidable. That's so hard, OP, truly. And I understand what you're going through. I've had friendships blow up or fizzle out like this, and it's really hard. Especially when you are the one leaving the group, which I have also been in that situation. Like you said, the post is kind of vague, but I understand the hurt that you're feeling and the pit that you get in your stomach when this happens. I think distancing yourself was the right move. If it's not good for your mental health and you just get a bad feeling every time you go, it's not fun. And the point of games and game nights is fun. You're supposed to have fun. And if you're not, leaving is probably the best bet. I hope you found a new friend group and maybe a separate D&D group so that you can play again. Well, I think I'm gonna move on to the next one. My group fell apart and I'm relieved. After two years of pretty good D&D, my group started to fall apart six months ago. Two of our players became problem players. Maybe they always were and I just hadn't seen it. They became disruptive, they fought about everything, and we couldn't get through half a session. I don't know when it happened, but at some point I started dreading Saturday nights. I don't really know why I didn't quit right then and there. I think I was nostalgic for the good times and I kept hoping things would go back to normal. Today, it became official. We haven't really played in like two months, but today I finally told my DM I wasn't gonna come back next week. After hearing that I was out, two other people quit immediately. I feel amazing. Last thing I heard, the two players left and the DM was preparing to start a new campaign. And I'm really glad I don't have to be a part of that. Short one to end it off, this one's kind of on the same vein as the other one, but less of a volatile situation it sounds like. I also understand that relief that you feel when you finally decide to leave the situation. And I completely understand why you stayed for so long. There's a little part of you that wants to go back to normal, that wants the group to return to the way it was before when you were all having fun. But sometimes it's unfortunate and it doesn't go back to the way it was. Most times it doesn't, if I'm honest. And it sounds like because the two other players quit that everyone wasn't having a good time. So I think you leaving was probably just the catalyst, and I think everybody else needed that too. And I'm happy OP that you're doing better and you don't have to dread Saturday nights anymore. Now you can have that Saturday to do whatever you want. Maybe watch some anime or something. Whatever you fancy. Well, I think I'm gonna leave it here for now. 
Thank you so much for watching. Please leave me a like and subscribe and turn on that post notification bell. It really helps. Also, if you have your own RPG horror stories or wholesome stories, feel free to post them in the comments because I do a comment section video once a week. Well, anyways, thank you so much. I will see you tomorrow.